Sasa. Si hilo tu pia. Kuna maasi makubwa kwenye taasisi ya ndoa. Paka ninapoongea sasa kile kinachoitwa ndoa ya jinsia moja japo mimi sipendi kuita ndoa. Mwanaume kuoa mwanamke, mwanamume mwenzie sio ndoa. Hata Biblia aiti ndoa ni homosexuality uchafu ulawiti twanao lawitiana hiyo sio ndoa ni uchafu hata wanaposema ndoa wanachafua tu jina ndoa hizo sio ndoa sasa wanaoa mpaka wanyama wanafunga ndoa kati ya binadamu na mnyama binadamu na mbuzi binadamu na mbwa paka mamba wanafunga kuna vituko hizo sio ndoa ni uchafuzi kwa hiyo taasisi ya ndoa imeshambuliwa kama kuna kitu ambacho kanisa maaskofu na wachungaji wanatakiwa wasimame kidete kukisimamia ni ndoa tunatakiwa tuseme sana hata kama dunia haitaki kusikia tutasema we will never compromise our mission and message we will never tuwezi kupoteza kiwango cha ujumbe wetu eti kwa sababu moja wa mataifa hawataki the united nations is not our standard umoja wa mataifa sio kiwango changu kiwango chetu sisi ni Biblia not the UN wala EU European Union is not our standard kiwango chetu sisi ni neno la Mungu watu wametokea kuogopa kabisa kusema unajua ukisema alafu sijui itakuwaje itakuwa nini truth must be spoken Tumoja akaniambia mzee makani unakuja Marekani kasema ndio Sasa utaweza kuhubiri huo ujumbe maana ukihubiri huku ujumbe huo huko hawataki kabisa nikasema huko ambako hawataki ndio nitahubiri Tu nitahubiri Watanvaya nini Watanvaya nini Watanvaya nini nitahubiri Nitaubiri. This is what I believe. If you don't believe, it's none of my business. Kama uamini, wewe usinisumbue mimi. Unataka niamini kama wewe. We niache mimi nasema naamini hivyo. Kwamba ndoa ni mwanamume na mwanamke. Nje ya hapo sio ndoa. Hivyo ndivyo naamini. Kama wewe uamini sasa unakasirikia nini? Endelea na unavyotaka kuamini. Lakini mimi naamini hivyo na Biblia inaniambia hivyo na neno la Mungu linaniambia hivyo na asili inaniambia hivyo na necha inaniambia hivyo na maumbile yananiambia hivyo na kila kitu kinaniambia hivyo na historia inaniambia hivyo na taaluma ya binadamu inaniambia hivyo saikolojia inaniambia hivyo anthropolojia inaniambia hivyo cultural anthropology inaniambia hivyo taaluma zote sociology inaniambia hivyo unaniambia vipi sasa Science zote za kijamii zinaniambia hivyo. Unaniambia vipi sasa? Should be spoken. Unajua kuna watu mpaka hata huko Afrika wanaogopa kukemea kabisa yasema sasa ukikemea watakusikia. Wakusikia wa, wa, <laughs> wa sasa wakikusikia watakufanya nini? You can't compromise our message. uwozo huu lazima ukemewe usipokemewa unajua tayari uko makanisani sasa hivyo uovu we uko makanisani uko makanisani uko makanisani uovu uko makanisani sasa hivi hivi mnaelewa eh uko makanisani uovu au uko nje 
Kwa lazima ukemewe uovu. Na tunapokuwa katika ibada kama hizi lazima tukeme huko uovu. Lazima ukemewe. Ukemewe. And I, I beg to differ. <laughs> As a preacher tafadhali. Wana siasa wako sawa tu akiongea hivyo. Sawa jamani eh? Wana siasa wako sawa akiongea hivyo. Ini political arena. They are right. Lakini in preaching. Amina. Katika kuhubili. Amina. 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 Amen. Mtu mwanamume kuoa mwanamke sio mira ya taifa lolote duniani. It's not a catch of any tribe of any nation. Naomba unipe wote mmetu mlioenda shule ni ipi ambayo mira yao ni kuoana wanaume kwa wanaume. Throughout civilization Angaria, civilization of Europe, Angaria, civilization of America, Angaria, civilization of Asia. Yote rudi mpaka stony age. Hakuna watu ambao kuwawa mwanaume na mwanaume, kuwawa mwanamuke na mwanamuke wanawana ni mira yao. Hakuna kitu hicho kabisa. Kila lilipo tokea, lilikuwa konde mdi na hayanzi leo imeanza miaka na miaka. Musa naandika torati katika walawi kumina nane. Anailani hiyo katika kumbu kumbu kumina nane. Inalani wa hiyo. Paulo anaandika katika warumi sura ya kwanza. Analani jambo hiyo. Analilani yuda anaandika. Analani jambo hiyo. It has never been a catch of any tribe of any nation. To me as a preacher, kusema kwamba, hicho kitu siyo utamaduni wetu, I don't accept. Mimi as a preacher nasema, hicho kitu siyo tabia ya mwanadam. It's an mystic. Mana when it's come just a culture, a culture can be adapted culture, mtu anaweza kai adapt culture. Sio ya kwake, lakini badaye, akai adapt. Pani, kuna culture ngapi, hazikuwa za kiafrika zimeingia leo. Hii siyo culture. Nanielewa, nimesema, in a political lena, I don't interfere. Lakini, as a preacher, mimi, when I refute it, siwezi kuhishia kwamba siyo mira yetu, it had never been a culture of any tribe, of any nation. Hata huko marekani bado wengi hawakubali. It's not their culture. It's your culture of America. Kwa ina zima tunyoshe. Tuseme sisi wahubili. Wanasiasa waache wanalimits zao za kusema. Waache mana. And the politicians are not our standard. Wanasiasa siyo viwango vietu sisi. Umelewa. Hata na wanasiasa na waweka pembeni. Siyo kiwango changu mimi. Umenielewa. My standard is the Bible. Full stop. Kwa hiyo nasema hivi. I beg to differ. I beg to differ. Me, I'm standing on the part of preachers. They see your politicians. When a when a siasa go with your arena, like in when I'm refuting it, ni napo ikata kama mubiri na sema hi kitu. They see your mira ya taifa lo lote. See your mira ya nchi oyote. It has never been. It is not, and it will never be. It's condemned throughout centuries. Imelaniwa katika vizazi vyote. Semeni ya mina. Unajua tukikata kama mira tu. Unajua siyo mira. Yet, people will adapt it. Kwa mba, okay, culture can be. Culture is dynamic. It can change. Kwa hiyo, siku moja, itakuwa ya kwetu. Hakuna kitu kama hiyo. It has never been a culture of anybody. Mimi naongea kama mubili. Sawa mmeni elewa wote? Ehe. Kemani menyelewa eh? Nimeongea za preacher. Politicians put them aside bwana. Wao wana namna yao. Lakini mimi za preacher na nyosha. It never it has never been a culture. Haijawahi kuwa mira yo, ya 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 ya, ya yoyote. Kwanza so far, mwanzilishi wa culture ni Mungu. Neno culture is a way of life. Mwanzilishi wa maisha, wa namna ya kuishi ni Mungu mwenyewe. Tunasema God ordained the culture. He has not ordained the cultures. Mungu ndiwa meanzisha mfumo wa maisha. Lakini haza anzisha mifumo mbali mbali. Mifumo mbali mbali mekuja kuchipuka baada ya anguko la Adam. 
lakini mfumo sahihi wa Mungu alioanzisha ni mwanamume kuoa mwanamke na mwanamke ni wa kuolewa mwanamke kami kamwe haowagi mwanamke mwanamke ni wa kuolewa semeni amina na mwanaume haolewagi kamwe mwanamume ni wa kuoa sema amina na Mungu basi ange akafanya hivyo hivyo hata kwa viumbe akaumba viumbe amina amina ukiacha vile vyenye chembe chembe moja au hai maana hapo lazima sasa niwe scientific maana ikisema Mungu aliumba viumbe vyote ya kike na jakiuma anasema eh mzee amekosea i am well of niko natambua na, na kuna vile viumbe vidogo vidogo kule ve chembe chembe moja au hai ambavyo vinazaana by by narration kumekeka tu vinatokea viwili achana na hivyo ninakuja kwenye viumbe ambavyo vyenye mume na eh, vyote hivi viumbe 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 vinavyozaa hivi amila aliumba cha kike na cha kiume cha kike na cha kiume kike na dume vyote 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 eti eti mpaka samaki eti au samaki wanazaa wote majabu eh samaki nao kuna majike na madume eh eh yapo eh? so wonderful hata nyoka eh? everything everything na ndege je eh kuku je eh ngombe je they have never mistake umewahi kuona tetea likapanda jogo <laughs> never jinga ujinga jogo ipande jogo ujinga kabisa yani unakuta wanyama wanabaki wanakuwa na akili kuliko binadamu this is ngumu kabisa kwa hiyo hii kitu lazima ikemewe na dunia ijue na ya kwamba hatutaki si kwa sababu sio mira yetu hatutaki kwa sababu Mungu hajaumba hivyo <laughs> mimi naongea kama mhubiri lazima hatukatai kwa sababu sio mira yetu no no tunakataa kwa sababu Mungu hajaumba hivyo is beyond the cultural barriers iko zaidi Mungu hajaumba hivyo mnanisikia wote Mungu hajaumba hivyo is contrary to nature inagongana na asili is contrary to nature inagongana na asili aya sumenielewa nimesema wana siasa nimewaacha utetezi wao baki hivyo hivyo lakini mi as a preacher I, uh, siwezi kusimama pala anapoishia mwana siasa i must go beyond mimi nina reference hapa mwana siasa na policies mimi nina principles mwana siasa he lives with the policies <laughs> mimi nina principles wao ni watu wawili tofauti policies can be changed principles cannot be changed kanuni haibadiliki lakini mifumo na taratibu zinaweza kubadilika. Sawa jamani, ndio maana unakuta wengine walikuwa wa komunisti, leo wameondoka kwenye ukomunisti, wanaenda kwenye ubepari. <laughs> Policies, lakini hii bwana haibadiliki. Ndani ya ukomunisti ni Biblia, ndani ya ubepari ni Biblia, ndani ya ukabaira ni Biblia, ndani ya wahindi ni Biblia, ndani ya dini zote the Bible is the Bible and is triumphing over all. Hii inashinda maadui zake wote na iko juu ya vitabu vyote vya dunia. Hii hapa. Yes. Azima ninapofunga ndoa nitume ujumbe duniani. Nadhani umefika. Sema amina. Sasa 